What is up everybody, this is Waze back with another video. Uh, I've actually started a JavaFX tutorial series, so I actually didn't finish that. So I'm going to start finishing my tutorial series on JavaFX. So in this video I'm going to be showing you how to install Scene Builder. Scene Builder is an application which lets you draw your UI by just dragging and dropping. All right? so, this is a website where you want to go, glue on hq.com slash labs slash scene builder and you will see this page and then all you have to do is just click on a download now and then select your operating system. So if you're using Windows 64, select that. Uh, you can find your Windows, uh, I'm going to go to this PC in my, and then go to properties and here I will see my system type so right now I have a 64 bit operating system so I'm gonna download a 64 bit operating system uh, scene builder so just click on download it will start downloading and then all you have to do is just uh, run the exe file it's taking a bit of time like one minute so I'm gonna pause the video and then I'll show you what to do next once it downloaded Alright, so it's been downloaded. I'm going to click on a run. And here you need to accept and then click on next. And that's the part where it's going to install. So you need to remember that. So by default, it's installing on a C drive, a users folder. And my computer name is a Wasemiza. That is why it's showing a Wasemiza. Otherwise, uh, it would show the different name if, if I had a different name or the computer name. So you might have a different name here and then app data local scene builder i have actually installed that so i'm just going to locate that file let's go to file browser and then we will go to c drive users and app data local and here we have a scene builder, right? So now how to set it up with your NetBeans IDE or Eclipse or IntelliJ IDE. So I'm gonna open a NetBeans now. And in NetBeans, you need to go to Tools, go to Options, select Java, and here in these tabs, select JavaFX. And now it's gonna ask you to put the path of your scene builder. So as you can see that I've already selected the right path for the scene builders. So if I click here, I'm going to go to browse and then you will go to away smoother app data and then local and then select where is it scene builder and then here go to app and uh, well you can just select the scene builder folder it automatically detect that exit file in the scene builder and just click on apply and click OK. So now if I create a JavaFX project and I will try to open JavaFX uh, FXML file, it will open in Scene Builder. Right, so in the next video I'm going to create a calculator by using JavaFX, so stay tuned for that guys. Thanks for watching, that was a quick tutorial on how to install and set it up Scene Builder in NetMeans and I'll talk to you guys in the next video. Cheers.